Well, hey folks, how y'all doing? The perfect pizza, a take and bake. Yeah, on the Blackstone, we're gonna show you how to do that today. Papa Murphy's, folks. I know a lot of you in this country don't have Papa Murphy's. It's a take and bake pizza joint, and they are phenomenal. That's what we're doing today. Let's get started. All right, let's get started. I've had a few people, here's some questions. People, uh, there's a couple of people asking me, can you start and stop the turntable? And then there is this button right here. So if you want to start and stop, if you want to stop it to put your pizza on, that's fine. I, I wouldn't do it for an extended period of time, but if it's like 10, 20, 30 seconds, uh, that's going to be more than just fine. All right, here's our pizza, our take a bake from Papa Murphy's. I know this is not across the whole country, but uh, this has got the, the world's stickiest dough. And uh, it, it has this tray that you can put in the oven. And there, there are some people say you put it on the grill, it will get a little hot, and then you, it removes real quick. Uh, but um, on the Blackstone, it gets too hot for this. So we're gonna have to, I'm gonna show you the method I use in order to get this off of there, onto a peel, and onto the box. All right, it starts with a pizza tray. Actually, it starts, starts with a pizza peel, sorry about that. And you put it like that. And you put your pizza tray on top of that and you hold it and give it a quick flip like that. You might lose a little something, but you can put that back on. And then we're, what we're gonna do is we're gonna peel this cardboard off that. All right, then I got some semolina flour, which I'm gonna put on this, on this backside. <clears throat> then I'm gonna put this back on there and flip it back and onto the grill we'll go. Look at that, over. 500 degrees already, folks. And a lot of people ask me the difference between this and the original. And the original took a lot longer to get up to temp. I don't even have this at full throttle, but I'm ready to back this down a little bit. And I'm gonna get a Papa Murphy's take and bake and put it on there. This thing is amazing how fast it gets hot. Look at that, we're almost 600 degrees. And that's what I was looking for. Pop of Murphy's, I did put a little extra cheese on there, a little cornmeal on the bottom. Just like that, folks, give you a look. See, 30, 30 seconds, you can see it's already bubbling up. Make some of those bubbles. Gonna be good eating here, folks. Yeah, be careful. Don't leave this. As it gets done, it gets done really quick. All right, take a look at the crust. Let's see. It's getting there. 30 more seconds. Right, turn the fire off. See, she's starting to smoke a little bit. Don't want a burnt pizza. Look at that. That's picture perfect right there. Give you a look, see at the final product. Papa Murphy's, golden brown on the bottom. Oh man, so delicious, folks. <laughs> if you don't have, well, I hope you do have Papa Murphy's Bio. Need to check them out. Excellent pizza. Great on the Blackstone. Uh, the new Blackstone definitely gets up the heat, gets up the temple a lot faster than the old one did. That was, uh, that was a three minute pizza right there. Uh, it was at 565, 70, and it went relatively quick. So good job at the Blackstone Pizza Oven. Papa Murphy's, Tom Horseman, YouTube. Thumbs up, leave a comment. And as always, thanks for watching.